Hi everybody, today I'm going to show you how to remove Outlook calendar duplicates using an application called ODIR. If you're using Outlook like I am here, you might have this problem where you have all these entries and they're all duplicated. These entries that I have here are from holidays in the calendar, in the United States calendar. So what's happened here is that it's added them all across the calendar and I have duplicated items. So it's really hard to remove one at a time because you would have to go through the whole calendar to do that. So what I've done here is I found this application called ODIR that will help me remove all of this. And so in the next few minutes, I'm going to show you how to remove all these duplicated entries if you have the same problem from your Outlook calendar. I have here on the desktop ODIR, the application, and we're going to click on it to install it. Remember to visit aramistech.com for all the information you're going to need to download this and the links of the application will be there. So I click on it to run it and now I'm going to start running the application and just click next to run it. Remember to have Outlook closed when you do this. Click next. Make sure your Outlook is closed and it's going to give you that warning when you install it. Uh, just click next again and it will show you the directory. Click next. It will just install the whole thing. Now it's completed. Now what we need to do is fire up Outlook. So once Outlook comes up we're going to go ahead and go to the calendar and on the top we're going to go to add-ins and you're going to see a tab called ODIR you're going to choose to remove duplicate items once you get there you're going to go to the calendar section right here in your list and choose to remove duplicate items this is going to take a while depending on the amount of duplicates you have in your calendar uh, for you know time sake I'm going to be moving this forward so I'm just going to show you a little piece, but it will be processing slowly. It might look at times like this where it's stuck, but it's not stuck. It's just working and it's going to take a while for it to do it. So this took me at least uh, like 30, 40 minutes to complete. Um, but just leave it. Once it's completed, it will remove everything. Like I said, it all depends on the amount of duplicates you have in your calendar. Once it's completed, it's going to do two things. Now you're going to see that it's going to remove all the duplicates, obviously, but it's going to create on the left hand side an old DIR duplicate items folder for the calendar. And it's going to tell you how many it removed from the calendar on that little tab that you saw. Here on the calendar now, you see there's no duplicates. I go through everything and everything is just unique. If you go to the old DIR duplicate items folder, which creates an, like another calendar, that calendar holds all the duplicates that were moved into that uh, area just in case that something went wrong you might want to save them so uh, if you look through it and everything seems to be good you can always delete that option you don't have to keep that calendar but it removes all the duplicate items into this particular duplicate items calendar that it created I think this also works for email you can try it remember to visit aramistech.com where I'll have all the links to download odir.exe the program and uh, any information that you might need there. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it.